Megan Smith is back on the hate train. Like we don't like what her. What she do now? We don't we don't like her. No, we don't. And so when she does stuff, we roll our eyes. But she pretty much put up a Instagram post that got a lot of heat, and so she is now gone private. Yeah, that's a smart idea. She said a man can choose to belong to someone, and if he does, he's considered noble. A woman is told she must belong to someone or she's not worthy. She continued and said, even in some of our great religious traditions, the goddess is rendered powerless without her male counterpart. And in others, the spiritual influence of the feminine of mother is not even recognized. Okay. She continued on with, we're <laughs> mortal women are worthy simply because we exist and those have cultivated our queendom, blah, 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 blah. Girl, bye. Right, listen, you destroyed you just exactly Will Smith. what you said. She Girl, bye. <laughs> Girl, bye. Ain't nobody trying to hear all your flippity flap, yeah. flippity flap. I miss my old Will Smith, and you destroyed his. You ruined being. Will. You broke him. <laughs> it's it's in front of crazy. us. And, it, and it's just crazy that she's still looking for validation on why she did what she did. No, it's she's just, still <laughs> doing. I don't think this is retroactive. This yeah. is stuff that's out there now. I don't belong to Will. Will has gone to movies. He's mm-hmm. got out here trying to make these little rap records, all this other stuff, and you still out here flapping your gums, lady. Go on, bye. I know. Nobody, bye. I don't want your book. I don't want you to talk anymore. I kind of just want you to say, I forgot about you for a moment, which was fabulous. I, I love Which it. is exactly why she's saying something. <laughs> I loved it. Uh, Kansas City Chief fans love them some Taylor Swift, but they might have a little issue with this. Though. Oh, apparently, yeah. Apparently, Patrick Mahomes recently spilled the tea that Taylor Swift has been making plays, Mm -hmm. like not giving them to the coach, but sitting with Travis Kelsey and trying, he said, and trying to understand the game, he's been showing her like plays. So she's been drawing up plays for him. Okay. They can go back and forth. Ugh. I mean, I would never. Don't nobody I want never your girlfriend touching the playbook. With an expert, you know, like they, they have won Super that. Bowls. Yeah, so I wouldn't, I wouldn't go back. I wouldn't uh, suggest any play or anything like that, but I would definitely. I'd go back and forth with somebody that's an expert. Kelsey was on an interview, and he said she's just been so open to learning the game. She didn't know much about the rules or anything. I think she was just curious about the profession. I know none of the plays have gotten to Coach Reed yet, but if they do, I'll make sure that she gets her credit. I know you were busy in a flood yesterday but you see did you see the text that i sent you yesterday about did did you see the contract okay that that's not real what no that's 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 from a that's from the pr company it was leaked that's not real what (laughs) i i saw what you i I saw what you sent me and uh this says that the pr company uh is it's on the 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 letterhead Uh but the paperwork which appears to have been created by la firm full scope includes the strategy and all that other stuff but Travis doesn't appreciate that it's claiming that they're breaking up because they're not breaking up. It wasn't just that. It's a whole layout Manifesto, of their if you will. Well, but don't you have to have that when you're like Taylor what Swift? Are, no, oh. a, a layout that says when you guys are going to meet, when you're going to have your first kiss and all that. And, yeah. like, and the exact a, date of but when But that's you're how gonna, they set it up. When you're going to break up date. I mean, everything, and you don't really see them out, which I get that she's extremely private, but this laid out everything, and they've been going back to dates where they were actually public and holding hands, and I'm, we're going to kiss on, you know, during my on concert this day, here. But see, I'm going to show up at okay, this game. But, but you don't feel that this was planned from him with the bracelet at the show when he was trying to give her the bracelet and the whole thing, and then we saw it actually, like... Yeah. It, it felt like it was a reality like, show. Uh, yes, and you've brought this up before that it could be a PR stunt, and I've always said no. Why? Mm-hmm. Because I believe in true love. Right? I no. believe in true love, too, it's, sometimes. That's fake love. That's fake news. But, there was a spokesperson for Full Scope that insists that they were entirely false reports and fabricated and were not created issued or authorized mm-hmm. by full scope agency yeah they weren't authorized to be published and let the public actually see what's going on all i'm saying mm-hmm. is all i've been seeing lately is all these conspiracy theories actually prove right yeah see you know what's funny though is like this said this is on emily's desk right now this is funny because everybody sees it with a desk kind of setting with staplers and stuff like and that. And a headline. And then it and, says and, full and scope at the time. Right. It's, like, it's like, come on, dog. Y'all don't realize we're being set up here. I don't know. The only Are thing, we? the only, I did think that we were being set up, but the only thing is just how accurate the, the dates are to everything that was going on. But it has to be accurate because 
it happened. It, it, it so did. to put up something fake on the internet, it would be accurate because we know those things happen. I fell for it. If this is fake, I totally fell for I it. I totally believe it's fake. I mean, the NFL just put out a whole promo for this season uh -huh. with Taylor Swift all over the all promo. All over it. Really? Yeah. yeah, all over the promo. This is the promo starting the season mm. from the NFL, and she makes five appearances. Oh, my God. They're players who get millions yeah. who ain't get one appearance in the promo video, and she's got five. Oh, my God. Well, we'll see because they're that. saying that later on this month there's a huge announcement on September 28th, which I think is going to be the they're whole podcast. Have to move Thing. Yeah, they wouldn't even do it now. Yeah, now they're going to have to. But so again, there's no way to prove that this is real. This is just really speculatory. This is stupid. So what happens if if there is a big announcement on the 28th and they they're actually it. they are not, they it's not going to happen. Yeah. It's not going to happen. They're, they're gonna, not breaking the up. And if they were breaking up, they're now going to stay together for another month and then maybe get it done before and Christmas. And that's going to suck yeah. too because they don't want to get to Christmas time. Dude, to be honest with you, man, I kind of want them to break up. I can't take another NFL season. I know. No, I Kelsey believe them. And Taylor Swift I talk liked them together. Every two seconds. I don't care. It was like prom king and queen in front of our face for America. Prom king and queen of America. You know what I mean? So I kind of liked it for a second. Not my America. Nah, it's fake. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, I don't like here. it. No, no. Taylor Swift and freaking Travis Kelsey. It was. I, don't, I don't like it. And now the fact that the, this has come out, like, even if it is fake, if they break up this year, yeah. that, the, the entire relationship is thrown out. Yeah. Like, it. I honestly, I I could care less. Mm. I just think that this is absolutely fake. Not the Rich king, people queen. with all of that power don't have people who work for them who leak that kind of stuff. That's you would like think that the the whistleblower from Tampa that basically told on the parks. Yes, the plans for the parks. And he's fired. That's now. a whistleblower. Right. Taylor Swift's people got NDAs. And all kind of stuff that's involved in that, they can get sued with yeah. by more money than God. Unless it was an intern or somebody that don't care. <sighs> yeah. Because right. that's what we, that broke fired. interns that work for Taylor Swift don't care. Yeah. They, they take their mama house. You crazy. I totally oh, fell for it. I no. fell for it. Don't do that, man. Oh, God. Don't fall for that, girl. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching the video. For all things wild, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel.